in our in our business finance course because it, it's called accounting so this chapter is about accounting this chapter is going to be made of 11 sections so it's going to take us a, a good amount of time to finish uh, the first section will be about payroll registered so when we pay in when we pay in our employees for example we have to have a payroll register to show that how much each employee is, is making, how much uh, time did they work, uh, showing, for example, their tax information. Uh, they have family, for example, in uh, coverage for insurance, uh, their per hour uh, pay, and all that. So we got this first section is going to be talking about this kind of register. Second section is going to be talking about the business expenses of uh, you know so a, a, a business has an expenses because we need to do uh profit so to find the profit we need to find out what's our expenses are uh payroll is part of it advertisement uh factory showroom rent uh office supplies all those are could be expenses when we use them uh so this is the second section the third section is going to be talking about manufacturing cost and time study uh, time uh, study so that means we have a direct material, direct labor, uh, manufacturing cost, uh, prime time cost. And so this is only going to be done in, in, in class. So um, uh, we continue with this section and then we go to the next section. The next section will be about the break even analysis. Break even when that's when, when profit equals expenses. So that's a, an important point that we need to work on. So we need any business need to know where is their break uh, break even point because after that that's when they start making profit. Below that they're still losing money. So uh, how we change the break even point? Uh, I'll show you this in school in class. Now we're going to be also talking about depreciation. Also there's something called the depreciation state line method, which is the easier method, and uh, we'll we'll do this in accounting and business. Remember this is an accounting uh, chapter. Uh, uh, there's an equation for it when you have the original cost then something called the salvage value and then you subtract it from from the original cost and then you divide by the number of years that you're going to be depreciating the amount that's for tax purposes by the way uh, the next section about uh, depreciation but by using book value okay that's what will be 18.6 also we're going to be explaining this thing here and chapter uh, uh, 18.7 it's going to be uh, talking about something called modified accelerated cost recovery system. It's a long title. Definitely needs to be talked about in class. Uh, it's hard to be talked about it here uh, in this video because it's a quick video. Uh, then you have the assets, liability, and equi equity. That's a, one, of, one of the most important things in, in accounting. That's your part of your accounting equation, by the way. Whereas asset equals liability plus owner equity, definitely uh, students who are taking it for the first time, they don't know what does it mean. So we'll talk about it. Balance sheet is part of what we just mentioned. And we'll continue all the way to 10, uh, 18.10, cost of goods sold. What we, with the item that we sold, they have a cost. That means we need to ca calculate because that's what, what's going to be involved in the profit, which is we're going to get um, you know, a gross profit out of that. Finally, the income statement, which is the most important things also, shows the revenue, shows expenses, shows profit and anything. Okay? So that will be an interesting chapter. So well, that's 11 sections. It's going to take us a couple of weeks to do that. Okay, guys, talk to you later. Bye-bye.